Listen, listen. I have something to share with you. Listen, I am free. Yes, I'm free from the bondage of masturbation. Yes, God has set me free. In the book of John 8:34. Bible says that whoever commits sin is a slave to sin. Therefore, whoever is in sin, you are in captivity. Now listen, I'm free. Now for you to overcome masturbation, listen to this. There are five secret things. You must forbid them. You, are, you must abstain. Bible says in the book of 1 Peter 2.11 that we should abstain from the desire of the, the flesh that fights against the soul. In the book of Galatians chapter number 5, verse number 24 says, those who are for Christ has crucified their body and this last. So whoever wants to overcome masturbation you must make sure that this flesh has been crucified. Now listen. There are five things I want to share with you to overcome. Number one, you must overcome watching lustful things. Things that are lustful. Example is pornography, naked picture, music videos. Stop watching all of it. Some videos on the internet, some comedy videos. All these things bring lust into our hearts. We must abstain from all these things. Sometimes when ladies are walking, the way you watch them, please don't watch it. It will put you to that captivity. Number two, be careful about bad friends bad friends because Bible says in the book of 1 Corinthians 15 33 that bad company corrupt good character some ladies are in prostitution now some guys are in masturbation now they were led by a friend because anytime they gather together all their conversation is about lust please abstain from bad friends that always call you on the phone and share lustful things with you on the internet whoever share lustful pictures with you block them yes number three Number three, be careful ab ab about the food that you eat from the street. Yes, the food that you buy from the street. Anytime you are going to buy food from the street, make sure to pray that the Holy Spirit will lead you to buy the right one. Most people are in spiritual marriage now. It's because of food that they ate from the street. They are in spiritual marriage Please, anytime you get food, pray over the food before you eat. <laughs> number four, yes, number four, sharing of items. Sharing of items, yes. Those who share their clothes, share their sponge, share their shoe, share their pants, their brazier, whatever with friends. Be careful. These things can bring lust into your heart, can bring lust. Some of them, you don't know the spirit that they are using. You don't know the spirit that is in them. Please, be careful. Be careful in sharing items with friends. If you do this, you are going to abstain yourself from lust. Yes, please. And number, number, number five, be careful of phone call. Phone call, yes. Some of you, around 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock, you are talking to a lady, you are talking to a guy, and all the conversation that is about, but some of the ladies... The men to call them. They will change their tone and speak in a lustful tone because they want to possess you. Guys, have you imagined that anytime you do call in the midnight, you see that lust possess you? Be careful. Be careful. Listen, many people are in this bondage. They are in this bondage. They can't set themselves free. Many young boys and young guys are in this bondage. In this last days, Satan is using lust to capture a lot of souls. Satan it's using lust to imprison a lot of souls. Please, if you are one of them, I've been free by Christ Jesus. Accept Jesus Christ and be free. Accept Jesus and abstain yourself from all these things I've mentioned. Now, whoever is in our bondage, now join me as we pray. Now, may God set you free by the count of one, by the count of two, by the count of three. In the name of Jesus. Yes, you see, I overcome Satan. You see, anytime you stop sinning, you can overcome Satan. Anytime, see, anytime you stop sinning, Satan is defeated. Yes, 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 yes.